Look at these. They are definitely new. I have not seen them before, have you? Even that one. Okay, lots of eye candy, right? And there it is. My dream. So today we are going to go to Harrods, maybe to another pre-love shop later on. Let's see how much footage we get. And yeah, Loewe has a pop-up boutique here. I would say let's go in and hopefully let's get inspired. Hey guys, so Gucci. This is the new Gucci Attach, Attach, Attach. Uh, bag and I don't like it. It's like a hobo bag. You can either like attach it there and then wear it around your body But it looks really weird um, I'm gonna put pictures of the model up and then you can also open it up basically the little GG there and wear it as like a hobo bag mm, Not the biggest fan myself, but oh look at this dragon Dress that's cool. Love this dress as well that is a very me, isn't it? And a little Diana back there. So black Gucci bamboo. What do we think about that? And a mini Gucci bamboo. New Gucci bags. Thoughts? It's like a puffy, puffy version of the GG monogram as well. God, look at this. This is like a vintage bag in crocodile. Here we have a little lizard bag. That green is gorgeous, isn't it? Gucci love parade. Okay, let's have a look. Little Python Diana, gorgeous. More bamboo bags. This one is new, I've just recently seen it on the website with the Gucci logo. Little backpacks, all very vintagey. I like the style and the mini size. I don't know if you've seen that on the Gucci website you can actually buy not only NFTs, but also uh, Metaverse Gucci bags. Have we ever talked about that? I thought that was very weird. Ooh, a little fluffy bag. And I love this coat. That is a style. Um, I really like this. Little Fendi baguette. But also what I want to show you guys is this new Fendi bag. All the models on the runway were wearing it. I love the tortoiseshell details. Another fluffy bag. And if yeah, you can see it well, actually, it has golden and silver details and then tortoiseshell. It's quite nice. More Fendi eye candy. These are new. I've never seen them before. Um, this we've just seen on the model. This is a python version of the bag. The little fluffy ones. Tiny little Fendi peekaboos. Guys, this is a new size. This is like even smaller than the mini. I have lots of them and look at this teeny tiny little bag. That is my hand. So small. Oh, I love these shoes. The first time I saw them, I, I just am so in love with them. And guys, look at this tiny little fluffy Fendi first bag. Can we see it? Prada. I mean, it's very Chanel-esque with all the little flowers, right? Looks like camellia flowers. It's definitely a statement piece. Okay, this is the new Dior display and I love the colors and the material. I mean, the design, we can, we, we can debate about that. I mean, that is very Dior. You could from afar kind of like see that this is Dior, right? But I love this one. <gasps> Maybe we have to try this one on. I always think if the perfect book toad ever comes out for me, I might consider it. Look at this material oh, and the gorgeous shoes. To be honest guys, I think that book tour would go really well with this brown jumper. Just flipping through this book while I'm waiting for somebody. Um, woman in Dior. And look at Lady Di. Wow, look at this beautiful dress. It's the launch day should be tomorrow. Oh, I just love it. It's so autumn -y, right? Yeah. It's perfect for autumn. Especially like with brown. <laughs> Inspiration from like uh, old house wallpapers. Oh, of okay. Things. Yeah, I, I just felt drawn to mm. it immediately. I always thought, like, when the perfect book tour is coming out, then I need to add mm. it to my collection as well. I just haven't seen anything yeah. that inspired me, but this is really gorgeous. I know we have a larger size, but it's in, in this blue. print as well. The blue, yeah. Oh, blue. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Hmm, what do we think? I love it. I think the colors are gorgeous. I don't know if you can see, there's like a golden shine. Um, there's like golden fabric interwoven into this. Oh. Hmm. Blue. Yeah, I think the other one goes with more 
clothing mm. like as well because it's more neutral, right? This is yeah, I would say. Yeah, I definitely prefer this one to the blue. What do you think? Is this a me book tote? Ah, and I mean, I could get my name right on the back of the bag. All the Dior micro bags. <gasps> Gorgeous. I still, once they bring it out in like the purple, like a perfect purple, I think I'm gonna get one. This is one of the sizes that's still missing in my collection. That's new as well. That is pretty. Do you see what I see? If that is not a unicorn, I don't know what is. So they have a lot of like exotics here. But that one, I don't know if I can go there. Let's try. <gasps> That's a unicorn. Wow. Hey, can we see that? They have tiny little stars that are forming the canache pattern. That is new. And these are new as well. And Chanel, guys. Let's have a look. Let's see what kind of footage we can get. We never know, right? This is a new bag as well. But guys, I have seen so many nice new totes as well from the recent uh, 22B collection. But I mean, you can't buy anything at the moment because we know the leather is just not real leather at the moment. Our Chanel 22B winter is coming. So of course we have a lot of black um, and tiny little bag. But that is just like the red one that Decop has and it flaked as well after a couple of wears. So you really cannot buy anything and be safe at the moment. The trendy in like a Tiffany blue kind of color. And there we have a little shirling bag. I don't know, maybe they are better quality, but I wouldn't count on it. Love this outfit really really like it and the brooch and there we can see a couple of little red bags a little white chanel bag from the new collection but you know see the leather just looks like all the other leathers that we're seeing at the moment i think it would wear really badly new chanel shoes guys i can't wait for autumn and winter to come i love this one of course because it's gold and wrinkled leather <laughs> and look at these pearls so louis vuitton i have just i didn't want to go in but then i spotted this <gasps> this is like a iridescent himalayan wow can you see the iridescent shine of it imagine this in a cup of scene bag <gasps> how gorgeous would that be right that in a cup of scene wow louis vuitton trunks and what is this what is this it's just homeware it's just a bottle <laughs> and a little head box wow guys okay louis vuitton downstairs in harris has a new artwork i mean we had the balloon there before right but wow look at this this is gorgeous look at this little bag wow that's the first time i'm actually seeing it in real life wow Oh, this is awesome. Yeah, this would be a petite mile for me. I can't lie. I mean, look at the details. I can't stop looking at it. My favorite wall, full with beautiful and rare couple scenes. I love mine. Just want a mini now, and then I'm gonna be super happy with my collection. There it is. Just upstairs, I told you guys I wish they would make this bag in the couple scene. <gasps> Oh my god, I wonder if we can look at it. I just want to have a quick close-up look at it, guys. Oh my god. Okay, that is the highlight, right? The hype bag at the moment. Did any one of you, like, got it? Did you buy it? Do you like it? It's so, like, over the top with the massive um, YSL logo. I, at the moment, prefer like a little bit of understated bags. You guys told me to look at the Cartier bags and here we are. Okay, they are gorgeous. Little details. It's definitely a pretty bag. Here's the classic black. I like it. Pretty. And yeah, definitely something to consider, I think. I would probably go with like the boring black again, but definitely an eye catcher quick look at what's on display oh my god look at these they're definitely new i have not seen them before have you even that one okay lots of eye candy right and there it is my dream a raisin kelly return and this is a 28 so this is a tiny size oh is it even a 25 guys it could be a 25 because it's so tiny um 
it is small. I mean, we'll, we'll take it, let's be honest. <laughs> but that is my dream color. I mean, you know it, but it's rare to see them in real life, obviously. Epson leather, not the biggest fan of Epson, to be honest. <gasps> Hello. Oh, wow, this little Birkin is to has a Togo body, but then a box calf um, flap. That is interesting. Oh, is that not the most beautiful color in the world? No way. An old black fur bag with gold hardware. That is the dream as well, isn't it? This is basically Jessie's bag, just like in a reddish color. She has it in green. Oh, look at these tiny little Min Lindy, not Mindy. <laughs> Lindy bags, gorgeous. And that one, guys, is a 35. It's huge. Um, never seen it before with these edges. And there we have like little Constance bags. I love this dress guys. I think we should try that on. It's here. Let's see what brand it is. You always want to have like some fashion advice as well. Aisla. Okay, I've actually never heard of this one before. Okay, it's a no. <laughs> so I think this is a size too big anyway. Like I have a lot of fabric here. Um, but look good on the model doesn't look good on me <laughs> one of my favorite brands at the moment self portrait honestly they have the most gorgeous dresses um, lots of tweets and it's just you know really really nice stuff I mean look at these dresses my other um, favorite brand at the moment is Alessandra Rich I don't know go and have a look on Farfetch they have such nice things and it's like really really nice I mean look at this this guys as Dior just not at Dior prices <laughs> so I really 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 like all of their little you know dresses skirts everything look at this one as well how gorgeous is that it's like a summer dress and I mean all the summer stuff's gonna go on sale soon you guys said you wanted to have a look at luxury home decor as well so let me know if that's something you're actually interested in Look at this Fendi dressing table. Wow, guys, need to show you this lamp. <gasps> we have a parrot lamp as well, but this is next level. God, look at this little bunny, I love it. <gasps> yep, I like it. Next dressing room, I'm just gonna fill it up with <laughs> ornaments like this and live like Iris up <laughs> You know, and just fill it up with lots of random stuff. Your home, anyone? Let me know if you spot anything that you like. What's wrong with me, guys? I love this stuff. The weirder, the better. You guys know this feather tree, you know? It's like a golden tree and then it has like lots of feathers on top. I always wanted that one for my future death dressing room, but I don't know the brand. They had it in Harrods once, but I haven't looked the brand up and now I can't find any more. If anyone knows what I'm talking about, if I find a picture, I put it up. Let me know. Beautiful London, guys. My favorite city on earth. 